a monumental figure. Minnesota politicians pay tribute to Dianne Feinstein's life. Legacy Minneapolis, Senator Dianne Feinstein. California's first woman senator and a trailblazer of American politics. Has died at the age of 90. Feinstein championed. A range of causes including CIA interrogation tactics, gun control, LGBTQ plus rights and the environment. The San Francisco native was first elected to the city's Board of Supervisors in 1969. She became mayor and then won election for a Senate seat in 1992. Five additional terms followed. Time equals 400 Ms. Greater than Feinstein earlier announced she would retire at the end of her current term next year. A number of Minnesota politicians have offered statements in the wake of Feinstein's death. Here are some of those testimonials. Feinstein was a monumental figure in Congress and paved the way for so many women to serve in the Senate, Senator Amy Klobuchar said. I'm grateful I had the opportunity to serve with Senator Feinstein, and I know her legacy will endure. Diane has been part of my political consciousness since I was a young woman at Stanford, watching her lead San Francisco through all the tragedy of Harvey Milk. And George Moscone's killing, Senator Tina Smith said. She was an icon to me, for her strength, how she threw open the Senate doors for women. Feinstein lit the way for women in politics to boldly live their values. Rest in peace, tweeted State Auditor Julie Blaha. I mourn the loss of a remarkable trailblazer this morning. Senator Feinstein was a blessing to our nation and an inspiration for its future. May her memory be for a blessing, Representative Dean Phillips tweeted. Phillips earlier this year called for term limits in the wake of Feinstein's absence from the Senate while battling health issues, writing, for goodness sake, the family, friends, and staff of Senators Feinstein and McConnell are doing them and our country a tremendous disservice. It's time for term limits for Congress and the Supreme Court, and some basic human decency.